This week's Sunday Express poem was inspired by Nigel Havers, who, in interview this week, said that most women still prefer cads. This is The Cad, read by Martin Newell. She was his one and only. He'd promised her a palace. He looked like Peter Lawford, but spoke like Peter Salis. He plied her with his fizzy from a tacky crystal chalice. He called her his own Lizzie. He knew her name was Alice. And if they'd made arrangements, she'd never find him there. A scarlet pimpernel of sorts, she sought him everywhere. Yet when at last she caught him, the tears, the rows and ravings, she didn't dare to leave him, he'd borrowed half her savings. He ran a string of women, like other men, kept horses. Eventually she'd learn this from sundry other sources. The jewellery was costume, the bling, the ring, the pendant. She knew him as Sebastian, they called him the defendant. And yet he'd had this patter, a way on him, so charming, he'd melt her with his phrases in language quite disarming. The cad will win the woman, which may appear a mystery, but good girls go for bad boys, and have done throughout history.